Engineering has a lot of problem solving abilities. You're trained that in school and I like it, using science and math to make the world a better place. I design projects from start to finish, looking at design standards and trying to balance uh, those needs with the uh, needs of the public. This is my job to try to make sure that everyone can get home safely at the end of the day and to make it safer for our emergency responders on the roadway when they respond to any type of incidents on our state highways. I oversee all things traffic in the southeast region and the mega construction projects on the freeways. Overseeing traffic is a huge responsibility. My main role at WISDOT is to oversee the bridge inspection program for 10 counties in northwestern Wisconsin to ensure they are in compliance with federal regulations. As an environmental coordinator, I feel like we're constantly learning. There's a lot of different areas to consider, including wetlands, threatened and endangered species, um, hazardous wastes on site. So we're constantly learning different evolving policies. I complete pavement designs for every project that we touch in the North Century region. As the Chief Structures Design Engineer in the Bureau of Structures, I work on anything from design all the way through construction of bridge projects uh, and other structure types throughout the state. Probably the most challenging and interesting project that I've worked on uh, was the I-94 North-South project a couple years ago. We had a really short accelerated time frame for delivering the designs and the construction of that project. I personally have been involved in the building of Rhinelander's very first roundabout. I run what we're out on right now, the NetPEP test deck. It's a national project evaluation program that's federally funded. and. We host one for pavement markings every four years. Last year, I led the inspection team for the Bond Bridge inspection connecting Superior, Wisconsin to East Minnesota. I manage multiple uh, highway transportation uh, projects for the region. Right now is US 51 Stoughton and McFarland. Um, I'm the quarter of project manager, so um, 18 point, over 18 miles of reconstruction. The flex lane, for example, in Madison is a, the largest ITS deployment in the history of the state, and it's fantastic to be able to work directly on projects like that. I think engineering creates a future by coming up with sustainable and new technologies to ensure the transportation system continually functions as needed. We are very future focused. Um, in other words, we were presented several challenges and what we're trying to do is provide a solution that is best for, for the traveling public, the locals um, that might be utilizing the road. A future is shaped by new ideas and the new ideas come to life through engineering and problem solving. It's one of those things where you are actually building something that does have a long lasting impact on everything we do. We create the future by providing the infrastructure to make it happen. Without roads, bridges, buildings, anything of that sort, our country can't function the way that we're used to. And I have a direct role in that. And that's definitely a sense of pride.